Rosalind. 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 Rosalind? Wake up, Rosalind. It's time for your training. Hurry up. Yes, Master Lavender. Darkness settled when these trees were still young. Will they ever remember the light that came before? Is she the beacon we've been searching the horizon for? Will she bring back the light? Lavender gave me my very own field notebook. In these pages, I will record everything I discover. For I am now a true archivist. I have always wondered about those tall trees in the distance. The ancestral forest. And today, because I am 18, I get to explore there. Rare plants and creatures must thrive under the cover of those branches. Today is your birthday, Rosalind. As promised, we're going to explore the edge of this ancestral forest, like you've always wanted to. Come on, Rosalind. Aren't you excited? You're a real archivist now. There's so much to see, so much to learn. I'll be with you the whole time, and don't worry, I won't get in your way. This is your adventure.
Look at those mushrooms, Rosalind. I haven't seen a specimen like that in ages. Go on, examine them. I know you want to. These mushrooms may look quite common, but there's something special about them. Can you see it? You should make some notes. You are quite right. Those are silver caps. Maybe you can find some more? If you study the samples intently, you'll learn all about the powers of nature. If you see the specifics of each, you will come to understand the whole, and you will behold magic in its true colors. Don't forget to use your true magic, Rosalind. Magic spells will reveal so much more. This blue plant is a salagush. Even a basic spell will pop it open. Go ahead, try it, and write it down. Water is easily harvested from the bellies of these fragile plants. A simple hit makes them pop with the pressure from the water within. The young locals gather around a sally gush and with hollow bamboo straws, drink the exquisite salty liquid straight from the flower. Hold on. Don't be too hasty. You almost missed these grasses. We call them Creeper's Brush. They may seem common, but they make a great hiding place when in danger. Hostiles will never look for you in tall grasses. Write that down, too. Under cover of these lush grasses, I may study the woods around me and the life it accommodates. And I am forever grateful for the creeper's brush, especially when my feet yearn for a rest. Stay low, Rosalind. Always. Down in the grasses, they won't see you. These deadly creatures are not of flesh and blood. You can only defeat them with magic spells. I know true magic is strong in you, 
so I'll let you deal with them. But watch out, okay? I don't want you... Rosalind, I'm so relieved you're back. You know I have faith in you. Still, I worry. Look at these most unusual veins in these leaves. Hmm, I need to make some notes. You can go ahead. I'll join you in a minute. But don't go past the clearing. The woods are a dangerous place. I can sense its dissonant magic already. Stay safe.
Blood streaming from the strangest bite marks I'd ever seen. What madness lurks in these woods? Lavender taught me about the spirit animals, and I remember the fox only reveals itself at times of great change. A creature this size must mean a terrible transition of some sorts. Ancestral Forest has called for you and your true magic. Go explore as a true archivist and unearth the secrets of this realm. 